Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel. Today is sample Saturday number five and I have a new adjustable razor for you. If you saw the thumbnail, you already know. This is the Yachi adjustable, the final cut. There's been a one version, there's been a two version, there's been a three version, and this is the fourth and final version called the final cut or the TFC. So this is 83 grams, has the same adjust, adjustment knot as the Rex Ambassador does, and as the Pearl Flexi does, the knot here. It's a, it is a two-piece razor. You turn this knot down here and the head comes off. But as you see, it doesn't have the same knurling here. The head is different. So it's the adjustment mechanism we know from the Rex Ambassador, the Gibbs, of course, originally, uh, and the Pearl Flexi. But the head is more like this, the Makur Progress. This is the extra long one. So, But you see the knurling goes the other way on the bar there. But it looks more, to me, it looks more like that than the other two. So this will be interesting. I have it set on setting three and I have a six, almost seven day stop ball. And I think that's a record for my channel. In it, I have my, I have my favorite blade to get the job done. Um, the Gillette Visamet Super Iridium. Um, the show for today, as this is a sample, Saturday is the Ariana and Evans Turkish coffee. And after planning this, I just realized that this is actually not available. I think at least not at Ariana and Evans or the shaving club or the club or whatever it's called. So, but this will be my first. This sample was very kind, very kindly sent to me by Mike. So Mike, thank you. So this will be my first Ariana, Ariana and Evans, the Turkish coffee. The brush for today is the Freedom brush from Yachi that they very kindly sent to me as they did with the razor, in case I didn't say. It's in the Six Solo white ball to show you what color it has. I don't know if you see the difference in color. It's slightly very light sand or, you know, it's not white. It has, it has a, a tone to it. What do you call it? Beige? No, it's not beige, not, not completely beige. The smell of it, I think it should be coffee, figs and cardamom, but this is a sample of course, so things may differ or, you know, be gone in the final soap, but looks great, has a good shine, but I only get figs, figs and cardamom, I don't get the coffee, so. But that's how it is. If you get a coffee in Turkey, they put spices in it, usually cardamom and other sweet uh, sweeteners, sometimes uh, cinnamon. Uh, so you don't get much of the coffee scent of their coffee either. So, but let's give this a go. I've been mumbling way too much already. I don't know if you see that I have a much longer beard than usual. I have a difficulty seeing the screen on the camera with the bright light in my face, but it should be visible. Okay, so my first ever Ariana, Ariana and Evans soap. Look at that. So maybe the coffee will be more noticeable when I get it on. I still get fix and lots of fix actually. Fix and must be cardamom because it's not cinnamon. I get some kind of a woody undertone. Can that be? I don't know. Maybe there is, I'm not sure. But I have the, the Yachi adjustable, the final version set on setting three. 
it goes from one to six and then it goes on again for another turn all the way up to three. So in effect it's from one to nine you might say. So this I have no experience with the Ariana Evans. This is the Kaisen base. Uh, I know there is a Kaisen 2 and I know there is a Kaisen 2E. So, but this is my first go with a Kaisen soap or with an Ariana and Evans. So I have nothing to compare it to. Have a nice knurling here. I can say right off the top that this is a little slippery, nothing like um, the Rex Ambassador. So I need to be a little careful. The weight of this is 80. Three grams. Oh, that's nice. One off the bat, this is mine. Of course, I have a three times longer beard than usual, or at least two times longer. So I expect a little more work for the razor. And that's why I put in the Vizimit plate. This is 83 grams. The pearl flex is 142. Uh, the Rex Ambassador is 108. So this is the lightest of the three, you might say. For me, when my beard is long, it's always around the mouth that I get problems if any and they are exactly the same length the plexi the plexi the flexi sorry pearl flexi plexi the flexi the Rex ambassador and this is exactly the same length Oh, that's nice. I just said that and then I felt like I myself. <laughs> when do I learn to shut up? I would say the setting three is uh, where feels like where I should be with this. Have you tried this? This is the final cut version. There will be a gunmetal handle version of this some, at some point. I believe at the end of January, beginning of February. I have it incoming. So I will of course be showing it to you. Let me just Grab my alum stick and see if I can stop this because, you know, it takes away my focus from what I should be focused on. But I would say the soap provides a nice cushion. Strength on the fix is about a four, so it's a little weak for my taste. This being a sample, of course, so you need to consider that. But I have to tell it like I smell it, right? So, slickness for this leather is okay, it's not great. It's not Sterling Master Soap Creation ish, not at all, or Wickham's. 
Not at all, but it's okay. But mind you, this is a sample and this is my first ever leather, so I'm not blaming anybody. If I will blaming myself because I'm the driver here, so. Feels nice on the skin. Nothing in the soap to irritate. You know, when you have a, an ingredient you don't use that often, that being cardamom, you're always a little worried if there will be any rea a reaction. I don't know what I get. I get a vanilla vibe as well. So a good guess would be that this contains vanilla, vanilla too. No idea. As this is not available on the website. I saw Silky Creamy made a video, a short video about this and I will be linking it below. So you can go and watch his. I didn't watch it because I didn't want his opinions to affect mine. But I will put a link to it underneath this. I believe he's not active anymore. Why? I don't know. It's kind of a mystery, if I understand correctly. What? Like with my Tuesday shave. Life gets in the way. So. This is a nice shaver. I didn't feel the need to turn it up or turn it down. I know that's how you should use an adjustable. But this feels, this feels very nice. So why change that? So if you have this, what is your favorite setting? I went with three today. It goes all the way up to nine, remember? Are you, are you uh, six, setting six man, setting four, setting three, setting two? Let me know in the comments if you have this nice eraser and it's not that expensive. I believe it's sold out at the moment, but it will be returning uh, coming the end of January. Um, so you should be able to get it. Um, at the moment of this recording, it's sold out. So let's have a sip of the coffee with no sugar in it. I got a full fat milk uh, a viewer on uh, last week's said try with a good cream or a good full fat uh, milk and this is my very first cup with full fat milk in it and that's actually nice so let's feel hmm that's strange nothing there very little on the neck so this on the setting three with an almost seven days growth is sufficient enough for me. So I would be able to get away with only um, only the two. So
So, that's it. Wonderful. Please find your seat. The captain is about to make his annou announcement. First one, 2022. He was on a holiday last week. So this is your captain speaking. Please be seated. Fasten your seatbelt. Put your table in an upright position. Relax. We are about to land this shave. Wait a second. Wait a second. I don't want the shaving police to come at me. <laughs> okay, let me just get this ready. Let me see. This is off. Oh, I can see that. Okay. So close your eyes and use the hot wet face cloth. Oh yeah. So far, and I know opinions vary. I know your mileage may vary and all that. But of the three, the Pearl, the Rex, and the Pearl, the Rex, and the final card, Yachi, I prefer the Yachi. There was no dragging, there was no suction, there was no tucking. And mind you, this was a far longer beard than I used with the Flexi. So, that's about it. The aftershave today is the only Turkish one I have. Is this one, Le Limon Cologne, or Limon Cologne, I don't know. It's, uh, it's uh, Limon, lem Limon, Limon, it's called Limon in Turkish. It's Limon heavy and contains a lot of alcohol and that's about it but if anything reminds me of turkey this is it lots of lemon scent very strong alcohol well in the scent of course in the aftershave not in not in turkey in the everyday life because they are muslims most of most of them so Alcohol is probably it for them. Okay, and the cream for today is this Nivea Man, and it's almost at an end. I had mice in it, I think. Some of the other members of the family have been using it, I think. I don't have proof because the camera is off. Is that soap or is that cream? I have no idea. Now it's nothing. Okay, so overall a fantastic shave with the Yachi, the final card on setting three, with the Super Iridium Visimut Blade. The soap was the Turkish coffee. I didn't get any coffee scent, but that's how it is. Lots of fix. The Freedom Brush from Yachi, thank you Yachi, and the Six Solo White Ball. I finished all this off with <coughs> this, the Turkish Doodle Colonia Lemon, and ended it all with the Nivea Man. So that's it. Have a wonderful weekend. Have a wonderful weekend. Stay safe and like, subscribe, hit the bell and share. And remember why we do this? It's because... We cannot help ourselves. No, it's because we are not obsessed. We are dedicated. And, you know, it takes dedication to be dedicated. Never forget that. We are dedicated. Six Auto, out.